Monday here, and we're at the CN Center with Paxton Nyberg. Paxton, how are you feeling out there today? Pretty good, all right. Gonna have lots of fun at the family skate here. And you're gone, pal. Game ejection. Okay. Keep going, you'll get a chance. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Oh, what are those? I'm going now. You're taking off? Okay, well, I gotta go help you get changed. Hang on, hold on, hang on. Where's the hockey okay. season going? Uh, Having fun? Rossi, where'd you learn to skate? Cooking school? What are you teaching me right now? Oh, perfect. <laughs> hey, Pax, was that fun or what? Good game? All right. Hey, what's going on? It is Tuesday. It's Christmas Eve, December 24th. The one time I didn't have to check my watch to see what day it was. And uh, I'm heading to Anytime Fitness because my boy, Josh Garneau, is a slave driver. No days off for this guy. So we're going to do that. And then we're going... I still have to go get my mom a present. She wants Abominable, the movie. I think that's how you say that. So I gotta go find her that, and then get my dad a gift card to Mark's Work Warehouse, which I find odd that he wants a gift card to the Work Warehouse, because my father just retired on Friday, last Friday. So that's pretty exciting stuff. And then we're gonna go to Starbucks and do some work. I'm gonna. Start working on setting up an email list because I got to get a good mailing list. I think that's probably the most effective way to get people back out to your shows and selling tickets. And then, um, yeah, I have to figure out my ticketing stuff for Australia. So, yeah, busy, busy day. And I hope you guys have a very Merry Christmas. This is for my mama because my mama loves me. She's the only lady who ever tries to hug me. Well, it is Christmas morning here. Not morning, afternoon. Christmas night. Christmas night, what'd you get, Pax? It's closer to Boxing Day than Christmas night. Nothing? <laughs> you know, I just feel like my present pile is not as big as everybody else's present pile this, this year. Is my yeah. Pile. It's small. Yeah, you didn't get any presents this year, though, did you? Yeah, I did. Hey, Walter, what'd you ask for for Christmas this year? Another dog? Dog brother or sister? Jade was underneath the book. Wow. Yeah, there's a dog pile. Want us to come back to the bed? Just leave it. It's fine. Is that from Walter and Allie? Yeah. What did they get to this year? You want to show us? Walter and Allie! Yeah! Does that have your name on it here? Yeah. Mirror, does it have your Walter name on it? And for who? For who? Walter, Walter and Allie. Allie. <laughs> <laughs> it's for Walter and Allie. No, that's for Paxton. Don't open Paxton's gift. Mm -hmm. That's for Walter and Allie. Oh, that one's good. Can't open well, that. What is it, Mira? A Barbie? Oh, I can Barbie. I can't open that Barbie. No, it's a special it's collector, collector Barbie. Barbie. Thank you, is that pants for, for is that some pants for the Barbie? <laughs> What'd you get? Cool. Oh, is that a Fortnite guy? Yeah. He's gonna snipe you in the face. Well, Liam. Alright. We've got all the essential travel info for Australia. <laughs> Book seems pretty sick. <laughs> feel like it should be like five pages. <laughs> Basically, it's really, really hot. And everything is trying to murder you. Pancakes. 
Yeah. Well, I know how to make pancakes. Your bedroom now. Yay! I can cook my own breakfast! We got a first aid kit for Finley. Let's see him. He's dead! Let's get him out of there. My mom thought it'd be hilarious to buy me more connects. Because of my comedy show. Look at her, she's killing herself. She's making it so funny. <laughs> Alexander Ovechkin. Yeah. Yeah. and chocolate got everywhere. <sighs> and and this. Packs. If you win a million bucks, what are you gonna spend it on? Mira, you. I think you won. You buy some Fortnite skins. What? You buy a flying car. I have 6,000 V-Bucks. I'd still pull you over. Hey everybody, we are down here at Sonar and we're getting ready to do an amazing show. We've got Dana Morrison on deck and the lovely Miss Sophie Buttle. She is a amazing comedian who just finished doing the Rick Mercer Just for Laughs tour and doing giant theaters all across the country and now she's here in Prince George. Because you got to take the good with the great, you know? And uh, yeah, we're going to have a good show and I will talk to you guys in a bit. Comedy show and now the real fun begins. <laughs> We're real voice. Why do you talk like good that? To have a We're good time. at the strike zone, ten pin bowling, where I like chocolate. Hey, I got you. I got you on camera. You're busted, bud. You guys want to see what a complete loser looks like? Look at this guy. <laughs> yeah. Double zero. Oh, we got a one. How did you get it in? It was, You're first last. You got it all. You're first last. Come on, bird of smoke. We'll get it, we'll figure it out. I figure by the second game, I'll have the spin figured, and we'll be rolling, we'll be rolling in it. All right, stay focused, eh? everybody it's Tuesday afternoon uh, New Year's Eve I guess it would be and we're packing up because we are heading to Quinnell to go do a show with the powerful Kenny Valgertson one of the funniest guys in the biz I love that dude it was a big part of the reason why I decided to take the show in Quinnell on New Year's and at 5 p.m. we've got an interview with the CBC. Uh, we're gonna go meet with them and do a little interview about me heading to Australia. We'll see how that all goes. Should be good, but uh, all in all, pretty exciting, eventful day. Uh, just getting ready to hit the road here. Hope you guys are doing good, and a Happy New Year. Finley wanted to say Happy New Year too, didn't you? Who's a good boy? Who's my baby boy, Finn? 
Yeah. Good boy. Yes, I love you. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. I just love you. I just love you so much. We're now in lovely Quinnell, and we're going to meet Miss the uh, Miss Betsy Trumpner from CBC, and we're going to do a little interview about my upcoming trip to Australia, and then uh, going to go meet Ken Valgerson and Tom Bassett and get ready for tonight's show at the River Rock. It is already sold out, so you can't get your tickets, and by the time this video is out, the show will be long over anyway. But yeah, hope you guys have a good time. Just got here to the Bassett residence and I get greeted by my man, Mr. Rocky. How you doing, Rock? Oh, baby, look at that smile. Getting ready for a show with Mr. Bassett and Kenny V. Oh, yes, yeah. the patented Rocky Lego that I've heard so much about. That's a seal of approval. That's how you know it's going to be a good show. <laughs> Rocky, it doesn't happen. Oh, no. <laughs> It's not Ben Bruce. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Look at this timeline. Look at that baby faced king. Oh, is that Michelle Shaughnessy? No way. Dude, that might have been the first show that I ever did. Right there. That very well could have been. See you, buddy. Rocky, what are you getting for dinner, bud? Oh, no, it's a treat. He already had dinner. <laughs> Which of these two? Oh yeah. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Take that one. Yeah, you got it. Good boy. Let's go into the room. Santa's been good this year, hey? <laughs> We're down here at the River Rock Pub, getting ready to do our show. We're in the green room. I just got my set list done out here. We've got Mr. Valgerson. He's ready to party. Got a fancy tie on. <laughs> What a beautiful meal they prepared here at the River Rock for Kenny and I. Kenny, what do you think of the first few bites there? How's it feel? I'm gonna just put this chicken yep. in it. Has, it has antibiotics in it because I don't want a chlamydia leg fucking chicken. <laughs> I want a chicken that had sniffles and it was fucking cured. <laughs> this, it has hormones. I want to bite into it and taste the fucking pipeline being built. <laughs> So yeah, it's fucking great. <laughs> Kenny Valgerton, everybody. It's gonna be a great show.
Well, unfortunately, I got a jet right now. I'm trying to make it back to Prince George for the show, or uh, for New Year's to my buddy Brett Keller's house. Um, Kenny's still on. I'm stuck around, I'm trying to be here for when he's off. But anyway, yeah, God, Jet, you guys, I had so much fun. I know I say this a lot, but I think that was my best show to date. It was, uh, it was so much fun, man. Like, I feel so good. Oh, is that the end of the show? Either that or he's absolutely killing, which he is anyway. Oh, he is off. Oh man, let's go see. Oh fuck off. Yeah. So hopefully you came out, enjoyed it. <laughs> All right, take care. Bye-bye.